Yo, what is up guys? It is Magic, bringing you a 44-3 on Nuketown. Uh, granted, it's not my best gameplay. I have a 48-2. Um, I will be posting it soon, but um, yeah, let's get into it. Today, we're going to be talking about um, my new channel and what you guys want to do. A giveaway and Black Ops 2 first thoughts. So let's get into it. Um, in Black Ops 2, I think all the guns feel really balanced. Um, there's not really one that overpowers another, except the SMGs, which everyone knows. If you don't already know, they are the kings in this game. Normally, the Sarvels, this is the first, so I truly think that um, since World War, uh, World at War, that the uh, SMGs are the best. Um, but let's get in my setup here. The best tier one perk, obviously Ghost. You have to be moving, but it still um, keeps you off the radar, and there's been a ton of UAVs. But I know uh, the Black Hat, which is really overpowered, uh, secondary nade, or secondary saw, it takes them out really quickly, but... Um, there's nothing you can really do about that. Just hope they don't have that. Part two, toughness or cold blooded. Toughness makes you flinch less, and cold blooded uh, keeps you like the keeps the name off your head, the red name that comes over your head, and keeps you off um, like the target finder and stuff like that. Part three, either dexterity or tack mask. Um, for game battles, I use both awareness and dead silence, but um, don't really use those in multiplayer. Not really much of a need. Um, otherwise, but normally I run no perks at all, or perk 3 at all. Um, assault Rifles, um, obviously you see in this game I'm using the M8 with, uh, I think, just grip. Don't quote me on that one, but I'm sh I'm pretty sure I am. And look at this load star, just go to work. The Reaper, but Reaper on steroids as most people call it. It is just amazing. But yeah, um, favorite Assault Rifles would have to be the M8 with Select Fire and Grip. That's my game battles gun. Or the FAO, which I just recently started using with Select Fire and Grip. And I put throw on a silencer because this is a, I don't like being seen, but that's whatever. MP7. Um, I heard I know T Martin when uh, he was pre-ranking his guns before the game came out said this wasn't very really good. I actually think it's better than the PDW. I mean, it's it and the MSC are hit and miss. Uh, they're both really great, but I would have to give it to the MSMC, which would be my favorite with grip, silencer, and the target finder, which is really overpowered. And you see right here, all the people leave. Tends to happen to me the most when I get on a good, when I'm starting to get a good gameplay. But, you know, it's just whatever. I don't get lucky like most people when you get 100 plus when no one leaves and stuff like that. And dogs in this game. I feel like they're really not as good as they have been. But whatever. Favorite shotgun would be the 870. Sniper, the DSR, which is uh, normally a one shot. They've done really well with the... Um, Hit markers in this game. I think anything waist or above, definitely shoulder above, you're going to get a chest shot kill instantly. And LMG would be the LSAT. On this map, it's really good. I think I have a few LSAT gameplays here and there. I might post one of those eventually. Um, you see right now I'm running a high tier streak, uh, high tier kill streak setup, or score streak, however you like to say it. Um, I'm running the Blackbird or Orbital VSAT. The Lone Star and the dogs. Um, like I said earlier, the dogs don't really do as good as they normally do. I think I've gotten five in my total time of playing, well, like, like one day, 13 hours. I haven't really used them that much, granted, but I've got five of them, and they only got me 25 kills for five I've ever called in, like five dogs. And with the Lone Star, I've called in like 20 and got like close to 200 kills. So you can see the Lone Star just does absolute work. And the low tier uh, <laughs> score streak setup. Would have to be the UAV, counter UAV, and anything of your preference. Maybe a hunter killer. But the counter UAV and the UAV, if you have them both up at the same time, get you 20 points and assist. So that means you're getting, it's almost like, what is it, a fourth, no, a fifth of a kill. I mean, that's not bad. So, I mean, at least you're getting points for people getting kills. Um, right now, I'm going to talk about the giveaway real quick. Um, what you guys got to do is sub... To this, uh, my channel, I got the magic, and on my new channel, Commentary Inc., and you will be selected for Nuketown Zombies, Zombie Avatar, or the Xbox Live Crawl Prop. All you gotta do is like this video, go sub to those two, and leave a comment down below. I'm magic. I'm out. Peace.